this is going to be a review on the even flow pivot expand double stroller so we are out and about today running some errands and i did want to go ahead and give you guys a quick review so i'll show you guys when we're getting out of the car we do have both children with us today i am in the back seat um our little one who is four months reagan she is asleep and then our two-year-old say hi <laughs> our two month I mean our two year old is um, about to get in the bottom portion of the stroller so I will go ahead and cut to that and we're gonna get out of the car and we'll show you how easy it is to assemble so this is my husband and he is just pulling it out of the trunk so all you do is unclamp it and that clamp came from right here is the clamp that you normally just unsnap it he is getting the little one out of the car but it does have a cup holder it has a really large bottom portion to use and then for the double portion of the bottom stroller all you do is press this lever right here so i can show you and it goes in and then it'll clamp out and then he's setting her right on so it just snaps right on the top baby's still asleep and then for the bottom portion, all you do is press that button, press that, and then now that is out. Probably gotta move it. And now the bottom is now clamped. And this is where Riley will go. So this is the lock, simple unlock. I really love the unlock button because it's so easy to press. And the entire stroller does fit in our trunk back here. Baby still sleep. It does have a cup holder that it does come in that you can pull off. And then our two year old is easily in. The things I do love is the, the canopies are very sturdy, but they are a little bit harder to pull forward sometimes. They, this bottom one does have a see-through net that you can see through there. Okay, do you like it in there? <laughs> no cameras. Okay, and that does cover her easily when she's in here. She does love it. Um, the, the good thing is the bottom storage is really deep. So as you can see, we have, I'll hold it, yeah. As you can see, we have our diaper bag and a few other things down here, and they are easily just they easily just slide under. This is probably my favorite um, bottom portion of the diaper bag. I mean, bottom portion of like the storage container. Now, one thing I will say is when you do add both babies on, it does get pretty heavy that you have to push, but that's gonna be I'm pretty sure with any double stroller. I will show you guys when we come back and get back in the car and show you the breakdown as well. So this is the result after some shopping. But we're gonna break this down and I will show you guys how easy it is to break it down. So this portion does snap into the back seat, um, very easy. The way you do that is you just press this, it's a um, gray button on the back and you just lift it up and both sides come up. So it does lean up if you wanna sit the baby up or if they're taking a nap. And then to get this car seat portion off, you press this gray button and then you just lift up and then you put it into the car. These actually come up as well come up and go down so if you didn't have the second portion of the second baby in the car seat all you would have to do is press that gray lever right there and then slide them down the rails and then slide it up so that makes the car seat right now the car seat is sitting the highest but it can go all the way as low as that black rail goes to get this off you just press both buttons and put it in the car you just press that gray button and slide those back And then you pull up on those gray levers just like that and then slide down and then it clamps on the side just like that and you pop it in all right 